Good morning, everyone. So, I woke up late. I was supposed to meet my aunt and cousins for breakfast at 9.30. That was 45 minutes ago. I slipped through all of my alarms. Whoops. Uh, I mean, I guess it's a good thing I didn't have work this morning. Otherwise, I would have been very late for that, probably. Because I don't even remember hearing my alarms. Which, you know, sometimes I'll be like, oh my gosh, I can't believe I fell asleep after I woke up to my alarm. No, it wasn't even that. I just straight up didn't wake up to my alarm. So, I'm headed there now. They said that, like, my other aunt just got there. So, like, they haven't even ordered yet. And it's like a five, ten minute walk-ish. So, I am power walking. <laughs> in an attempt to get there on time. It is very bright out here. That's why I keep like doing the whole like this thing. I'm really excited. Uh, a lot of these people I don't get to see very often. Uh, I'm not sure if my Uncle Chris will be there. My Uncle Chris currently lives in Germany uh, and all of his kids and yeah. so I like haven't seen them for years. So I'm very excited. I don't know if he's even going to be there but even, even if he's not I know that my cousin's from Montana. I think that's where they live. Uh, one of those states that starts with an M and is out there. Yeah, that's where they live. Uh, but they're gonna be there. I'm gonna get to see them for a little bit. I'm real excited. Even though I'm totally gonna be late and they're like probably gonna be like halfway through their food by the time I get there, but whatever. I'm excited to see them. I'm done. <laughs> So many humans, and this is so not even kind of part of my family. I mean, they are they're part of my family, but they're not the only part of my family. Yeah. That makes sense, right? Right. Totally. Totally makes sense? <laughs> Completely and utterly. Right, Bailey? Right, I'm stop. No, I'm not. Makes sense? <laughs> <laughs> I just got here. They're already talking about leaving. I don't like me. I, I took three oh. chips. Oh. That's a lot of checks. Probably because, like, everyone got their own junk. Maybe. You didn't get your own junk? No, I did. I got mine and my little bros. You're paying for your little brothers? I'm so not paying for my little sisters. Bailey can pay for her own junk. <laughs> huh, Bailey? Say yes. <laughs> she knows better. <laughs> huh? Thank you. Do that. It's weird. This, this is weird? No. This is weird? And I'm home again. Yay! It was, I love hanging out with my family. They're a lot of fun. Um, they are really rowdy and really loud. So I feel bad for any waiter who ever serves us because like we cannot get organized to save our lives. Probably. I have uh, 45 minutes until I like have to have to have to start getting ready for work. Part of me is excited to go back to work and part of me is not because I miss my friends at work and I miss seeing people. But also it's work. Which... You know, can go any way you want. Okay guys, so I just got home from work and I ran to check our mail and I'm very excited because I got a package. Now I know exactly what it is and I'm very excited for it. So some of you may not know, I own a corset and I really like it. It feels like it's just giving me a hug all day. The problem is it was an over the bus corset and um, the bust part didn't quite fit well. Uh, it, it kind of like pushed, it, it didn't work. Did not fit well at all. So I've kind of been watching the uh, website that I like for some clearances on some underbust corsets in my size. 
which I wear a large size, as you may or may not be able to have guessed. The other day, one went on sale that I, I liked for like 30 bucks plus, like after shipping and handling. So, that's what this is. And some people think the corset thing is weird, but I'm okay with that. Because I think they're very comfortable. And, like I said, it just feels like it's giving me a hug. And I like it. So let's see. Looks like this. Yes. And honestly, I don't think it's going to hold up as long as some of the others that I've got. Um, but it does have steel bones in it. And it's all like mesh. I'm gonna put it on and see what it looks like. Okay, so here's what it looks like. Ignore the mess on my bed. I haven't quite finished unpacking yet. But um, I didn't finish like lacing it up all the way. I could It could definitely go tighter. But to be quite frank, it's 11 o'clock at night. I just got home from work and I don't feel like working that hard because <laughs> it takes some work to lace me into a corset all the way. There we go. See, look at, look at the shape that it gives. And like I said, it just feels like a big hug. Just hugging me all around my tummy. <laughs> Which I know sounds kind of weird, but it I like it. Um, I would probably wear it underneath something. I probably wouldn't like wear it on top just because it is kind of, like it doesn't really have a pattern or anything. It's just mesh. So I would probably like, if I had something tight to wear, I'd probably wear it underneath that. But I really like it. I'm happy with it. And I don't like tight lace, like some, like you'll see a lot of girls like when their waist is like this big around and like there's a definite change in their shape, but I don't go that far. I uh, need to still be able to breathe, <laughs> which even when I'm in, like, like I said, this isn't laced up all the way. It's not even like as tight as I could get it or even as tight as I would normally do it, but I just, like, the urge is there to breathe deeper, even though even, like, this, my rib, it's, like, almost underneath my rib cage. It's not even hardly, like, constricting my breathing at all. But I still feel, like, the instinct to breathe deeper when I'm in this. I don't know why. Okay, so I changed my mind. I'm actually going to take it for a little bit of a field test. Uh, in my first corset, like I said, it, like, hit here, and it, like, pushed these up higher than, like, I... My roommate once commented that while I was wearing my corset, I could take a nap on my boobs. Which is not actually nearly as comfortable as it sounds, because it kind of restricts all up in here. But it's the, that problem was definitely compounded when I was sitting. So first thing I'm going to try is just sitting down, because norm, you, know, you normally like kind of curl over to sit down, but you can't really do that in this thing. So, ready? <laughs> yeah, I definitely can't. <laughs> uh, <laughs> yeah, there is no slouching in this thing. I <laughs> can't do it. Uh, and if I sit back, because oh, that like it feels, it's easier to sit on the front because I can like keep my back straighter, easier. But this one, it's like, okay, I kind of have to like, like once I'm down, it's comfortable. I just kind of, it's the getting there and. I'm quite happy with my, where my boobs are. They've pretty much stayed, they're a little bit more elevated. I'm talking about my boobs a lot more than I normally do. I normally don't talk about them this much, especially not on the internet, but whatever. Um, continuing with the boob talk. Uh, they're not, like they're a little bit higher and more pushed up than if like I wasn't wearing anything at all. I mean, aside from, you know, a t-shirt. Um, but they're not like up to my neck and like, choking me so that's nice the one thing i am noticing though is because of just the slight push on my boobs from where they would normally sit uh they are like like my neck doesn't normally do this when i'm just laying down uh but my boobs are being pushed and not being allowed to go in the normal way that they would so i'm keeping the kind of like silhouette even though I'm laying on my back so that's a little weird I don't know maybe my neck does do this and I never noticed that's entirely possible as well 
I'm just gonna be playing with my chest this entire vlog. That's that's Kendall plays with her boobs. It's gonna be the title of this video. No, it's not. I'm never gonna title a video of that. Probably. I am tired. And also I have stuff all over my bed. So I can't go to bed until I finish that. So I should probably go finish that. But I'm very excited that I got the corset.